as an entrepreneur to kind of get through, you know, uh, days, day after day, year after year, mm -hmm. as just being working for yourself or trying to succeed in your career. Mm -hmm. So tell me what you've been, what you've been doing lately. Well, it's the pandemic happened. So that changed everything. And being like independent artists has been quite challenging yeah. because you can't uh, perform live anymore. And a lot of gigs that I got offered basically canceled as the pandemic started. Um, but I've been working on my own music, writing songs, releasing music. I started learning how to direct music videos. Oh. So I had actually a song called Strange Life. And I got this girl who looked like me to dance in a video. And everybody Ooh, thought it was me. That. I do too. Yeah. Everybody thinks it's me. It's not me. I'm filming it. But I'd rather like be sometimes behind the camera because then I, you know, it's a different static uh -huh. and vibe. Um, but also I wrote our friend Steve Griffin. Uh -huh. um, he worked on a movie called America the Motion Picture. It's an animation coming out in theaters on the 4th of July. And he didn't I'm, call me. What the hell? I know. Well, he's, <laughs> no, well, he has gigs, but <laughs> yeah, no. I got to sing um, the opening scene for the movie with Chainum Tatum. It's basically yeah. a comedy if America was founded again, and it's hilarious. It's yeah. going to totally, like, it's going to do well. So I get to sing. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, so I got SAG, and it might be nominated for an Oscar, maybe, as oh, an animation. That's what's and up. I can raise my rate because I teach music. No, I know that's right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, so you. Basically, you've been in the business for a minute, mm -hmm. you know, so I mean, and we always talk about, you know, the good time. What, 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 what was it that, that had you? I mean, I'm sure that there's, there's been some downtime, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Especially with the COVID going on, mm -hmm. you know, like how you got through that or whatever, as opposed to working to get gigs and mm -hmm. stuff like that. You know, what? how did you manifest? How did you work out to get to that? You know, to you stay to, to, to positive, stay, stay positive yes, for yes. the pandemic and mm -hmm. the music. To learn new new instruments, I just bought mm. a harp. Oh, okay. a harp! I bought an electric harp, okay. and I am now <laughs> trying to master this instrument, which is so much different than guitar, piano, drums, bass, and ukulele. Uh -huh. It's like a, the fundamentals of a piano, like music music wise. But so that's like what I did, and also um, just collaborating with other people, learning how to program better beats and different programs just try to stay busy you know and creative uh -huh. and not like in my apartment all the time because yeah. i drive me mad yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Got it. why the harp because it's unique absolutely it's, I, but it's, I agree. the cool thing is because it's an electric harp so basically because i i play like lead guitar i mean today i'm doing acoustic stuff but you can plug it into a pedal board right so i can rock it with distortion with delay and I wanted to do something that not everybody's doing. I always try to find something interesting. And I always had this, like, interested – it was always interested in the harp mm -hmm. because it just seems unique. And it, this harp I have is um, like a half a size of a harp. It's not okay. like the big, you know. So I can put it on and I can walk around and, you know, dance with it if I want. Yeah. God, mm -hmm. I've never seen anyone play the harp, like, aggressively. Yeah, no, that's – that's like elegant – Yeah, no, no. This <laughs> I have a whole – and I'm planning to do a video, actually – I'm, a, I'm actually composing a song this week where I'm going to do a uh, loop five different instruments with including the harp, the guitar, the bass, the ukulele and the organ and my voice. Maybe not the ukulele, but the okay. voice. Like the guy in New York who has like the drums around his back. Yeah. And, like, well, no, I'm, but not quite because it's going to be in the studio where I, I go to different instruments Got and then you. I loop it. It's quite difficult, but I that's like my task that I want to do right now. I have a whole vision. So Very yeah. nice. you're this multimedia entrepreneur. You do you direct, you do yeah. music, which which is your favorite? You also act? Is that how you Yeah, I haven't acted in a minute. Yeah. Um yeah, yeah. me and Fuel, we <laughs> what what's the scene we did? What did we do? Uh Oh, uh, uh, oh, oh my God! It was. Or was it? We did, we did. No, no, no. Good. Yeah, we, Goodwill we, Honey. <laughs> it was Goodwill Honey. Good. It really? was a scene from Goodwill Honey. We did. Yeah. No yeah, way. Was. Yeah, yeah. No it way. Was argue, remember, it was the argument scene. Uh, oh my God! Uh, in the bedroom when they was in the bedroom, or whatever. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Oh and my you didn't God. give him none. No, I'm just kidding. You were in Goodwill that was, Hunting. That was the scene. That was the. I don't. Oh, that was the we class. Did a few, we did a few things. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh my god! I forgot it was that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So that was it was that. Or whatever. Yeah, yeah. It was, it, I, I think I, you know, we held our own. Yeah, you know we, it, was, it was fun. It, it was, didn't make us cry. <laughs> yeah. I love I love acting too. It's yeah. fun. I mean, anything is I mean acting, suppose theater, expressing yourself. I love all of it. You know. Yeah. Um, oh, sorry about so, that. Do you guys ever get nervous in acting class? Like you're you're around nothing but competition. 
And uh-huh. then you know you always got your overachievers come in trying to kill yeah, it. Yeah. And then you got to follow that. Mm-hmm. You get like nervous and just like, oh, I'm I get mad. I get nervous to remember my lines correctly, but okay. I have a like. I yeah. don't know if we did pretty good though, but he, but I meant I yeah, remember we, we rehearsed off, off a lot. You know, yeah. yeah, we have it was rehearsed fun. a lot. But when we got up there, in, in, any time you perform, you're gonna have at least most people I know is still gonna have a little jitters. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Uh, with me, my heart may be you know pump a little fast or whatever, and I have to like say the whole red letter, yellow letter, red letter, yellow. Yeah, 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 <laughs> you know yeah, yeah. To kind yeah, of get yeah. back in the in the I remember you were shaking. You down. Yeah, a lot. you know like what I'm saying? Yeah, <laughs> I was shaking that bad. <laughs> I wouldn't have that. So what you're saying is he's a little bitch. <laughs> you know he had to get in on that. No, 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 no. No, yeah, but you, you get hot, nervous. You, you, you get you nervous. Hot, no. no, no. Somebody put me out on Jay the JD is doing the selfies well dressed today. <laughs> I ain't going to say nothing. Yeah, yeah. He, he, he got me off guard. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, wait, that's all right. You know your show's coming up. <laughs> and who got control then? Nah. Anyway. Yes. So what do you have coming up as far as your own gigs? You got so, the, the five what five instrument? Yeah, well I'm, this gonna show. be a, like a film. I'm gonna film it and then put it out and hopefully it will caught you know, people yeah. will see it. Because it's kinda unique what I'm trying to do. So that I'm hoping we catch some attention. I wanna tour, I wanna play out. I wanna you know what I really wanna do is something uh-huh. I've been thinking about for a while. I want to start a um, music festival with uh, female artists. Like, okay. Kind of like instead of, they used to have one many years ago, but but I want to find some kind of parking lot, a start as small, like here in North Hollywood or something, uh-huh. and have it be, not to say I don't like men, but just female front artists. Oh, all right, of right. them. Getting a little... <laughs> me too, me too. But, but I, I have this visual, but also different cultures, like with different women from different cultures coming together. Because a lot of times I feel like women are so competitive with each other. Mm-hmm. And I would love to have women come together and work together. Okay. Yeah. Uh, that's yeah. A thing. So there's something I want to do too. Like, and also just bring back, yeah, live music somehow. Because people want to get out right now and see live music. You know, just. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's. We I, just I, I think if somebody, if you if you actually get out there and, uh, and put a concert on or something, I mean, it's a, you can make a killing now. Everybody oh yeah, and everybody yes, yeah, hungry. You know yeah, yeah, you know yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. So there, it's a good time to do that. Yeah. Um, so what do you have as far as like immediately like coming on? Because you're working on a LP right now. I'm working. So what I'm doing, I'm doing a lot. I'm doing so many things. I can't remember what mm-hmm. I'm doing. Uh, well, the, the filming the video that's like number one. Uh-huh. I just record a bunch of music for an art project that my friend is doing with her husband that's gonna they're gonna perform it in manchester in england so like i do this little small gigs where i play on people's songs and stuff uh right now i'm just writing a bunch of songs and see where they land i might even sell them i might pitch them okay. um yeah cool so, cool yeah all right well we're gonna we're gonna oh did you have another yeah, yes. yeah. My bad, my bad. I'm sorry, this, my bad. this might be the closer but don't, don't <laughs> i believe in balance you know yeah. yeah with that being said who's your favorite male artist Oh, wow. No. <laughs> wow. Well, I mean, I have so many, but I mean, maybe they influenced me to write music when I was a kid, kind of like the first or just now. I would say now, your favorite. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Ooh, that's a I don't know. That's, that's a shame. Oh, I loved, I loved Stevie Wonder. I mean, that's, uh-huh. that's, yeah, I would say, yeah, he trumps most. I mean, David Bowie. Yeah. Very nice. Uh, Oh God, I lose here. Um, <laughs> I think also Maynard from Tools, phenomenal singer. Um, yeah, I don't think about that. There's a lot. Yeah. Jimi Hendrix. I don't, yeah. know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Like, um, there's a lot. It's just like completely can't think of it. Right, 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 right. Yeah. That's but cool. I'm, I'm very diverse. Like everything I do, I can write. Pop Even your songs. music, yeah, the stuff that you write is, is just, very diverse. I don't yeah. just do one thing. That's the yeah. thing. It's hard for me to say in a link because I love. I'm inspired by everything, but maybe like super cheesy country music. Right. Maybe not. But <laughs> besides <laughs> you, that, you did, you did yeah. a Michael Jackson cover one time, right? Didn't you? Yeah, so, yeah. I, I toured in a Michael Jackson tribute band. Yeah, we were touring in berlin yeah for a month. you know what i mean so look yeah. at you look at you girl uh, so since so wait wait wait, wait. did i cut yeah. you off again she's opened up a whole new lane, <laughs> uh, a whole new lane. I, I used to play the beaded solo every single night okay yeah so do you hate country music or do you hate certain country artists no no there's Ooh. no hate here there's no hate i don't <laughs> hate i don't hate around here I, there's no hate here it's all love oh, um boy. I like I like when it's heartfelt and it's real and not plastic. Okay. And I think sometimes like some country can be a little 
but but I like country too though I really like the old country though like Johnny Cash and that but also there's a lot of cool country right now that's coming out but there's some I can't stand some you know mm-hmm. you can't like everything say a name say a, give us a name no please no I can't I don't want to. no 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 no, no, no. Uh, what's that what's up brother who's that who's that uh, that Casey. is Cofield. Cofield. What's up? What's oh, William, up? What's up? William Cofield. What's up, William? Man, sorry, we we, we kind of late on that. Uh, uh, you know, but we, I got you, man. That's what's up. That's what's up. Continue to share, you guys, because we are sharing from uh, uh, from broadcasting, from Fired Up Broadcasting, as opposed to the other pages, and kind of share on those pages or whatever. But uh, we got so many shows right now on Fired Up Broadcasting that we want everything to come through there and share it out, and race it out to the world. You yes, know sir, what I mean? Yes, sir. So, uh, Emma. We're going to get another selection by you pretty soon, right? Next. Yeah, I, can you kind of tell what it is real yeah, quick? And then... It's quite interesting. So the song that I just opened up with, it was called This Feeling. And I used to have a band called Crystal Twin. Now you, oh, yeah, you I remember used to come yeah, to those shows. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and I wrote a song called This Feeling. It's kind of like a, I, I, it's kind of like country. It's somebody I just went out with. So that oh, sounds like a country song. Um, uh-huh. But um, that was actually placed in Shameless, the TV show. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. It was. It was. It was, in, was a they used to song in Shameless, which is a pretty well known TV show. Oh, I yeah. think, right? No, I was yeah. on. Well, no, that wasn't Shameless. I'm sure. Yeah. Shameless is great. I was on Hunk. I but, was thinking of Shameless. <laughs> don't, don't look at. Give me that look. Oh, I'm gonna look like dirty, like, dirty. <laughs> <laughs> I see that look, dog. I see that look. <laughs> but anywho, anywho um, sorry, go ahead. Go uh, ahead sorry. Oh no, I lost my my. I know, right? my, my shameless, song shameless. Shameless. Uh, So I I went uh, when I went through like a bunch of songs because I written so many songs and when you play acoustic guitar, like some songs that I write doesn't work on acoustic guitar because you mm-hmm. do like the guitars and electric or whatever. But I wrote a song called Tilda when I was seventeen, uh-huh. and it got me a development deal with Warner Chapel. Also got me a like a big grand in Sweden and I haven't played it for years and years. Yeah. So I'm just going to do that song. And that's kind of like a ballad song. Okay. Yeah. That's what's up. Well, we'd be looking forward to yeah. hearing that in a few. We're going to let you get ready. Okay. And Sounds while good. we do that, do we have other guests coming in? Where'd Nigel go? Uh, Nigel just kind of disappeared. He's a, he's <laughs> he's a, a mystery. Right? He hasn't come yet. Uh, <laughs> you know what? He probably went